Hi everybody. Um, today is Friday, July 22nd. It's my friend's birthday, so if she ever watches this video, happy birthday. Ah, love you. Anyway, um, I'm looking like this because I get aggravated when I do not like my hair, okay? Um, the guy I go to, he, he twists well. I pay $60. I typically go about every three to four weeks. But he cannot style. And, he, you know, he's a nice enough guy. But I think I might, I don't know. I might have to go elsewhere or start twisting myself because... I always leave his shop with stuff like this. Like, I gave him directions as to what I wanted him to do. It was very simple. He gave me a mohawk before. I told him I wanted thin twists. And I wanted it down the, like, at the halfway mark. And I wanted the rest of it out. He did sort of kind of do that. But it looks crazy. Like... If you do, it was going to look crazy. Tell me that's not a good idea. But my main thing, sorry, I'm trying to figure out the camera. What, what is this right here? What in the world is that? I don't know. I'm walking outside looking like that. Let me do a twist, a turn, or whatever real quick. I don't know. I'm just looking at the mirror, and I'm looking at myself, and I'm just getting aggravated all over again. Anyway, let me turn. It's not absolutely terrible. I'm going to see if I can do something to fix it. If not, I'm going to just take it out. So here we go. Okay, and then you see the top. Okay, all right. So, one, the twists in the back are uneven. Like, some of them are small, some of them are really fat. And I know your hair, some of the locks are different, but, like, take the same size sections. I don't know. It just, like, he's done my hair several times, and it looked very nice. So, I'm not understanding what's going on with his styling. Like, the first two or three times he styled it, it looked great. But these last two or three times I've gone, I'm just like, what in the world? What are you doing? And I'm wondering, like, are you high? Are you hungry? Do you need a hug? What do you need to get my hair right? <laughs> anyway, let me back up a little bit. Um, I have my little earrings on. These are my favorite earrings. I love them. Aren't they so cute? I got these for a dollar, y'all. A dollar, okay? I got them for a dollar like three years ago, and I love them. They haven't changed <laughs> or anything. I'm so excited. Anyway, oh, and look at my nails. I really never, well, I get pedic manicures and pedicures when my shop has a sale. They have a sale for both for $30. Um, every week so every like two to three weeks I go but I said I work with the uh, teenagers so I was like oh let me try to be fashionable and I got like this little <laughs> color block thing on my nails or whatever I know this is beside the point but it's gonna make me happy for the moment while I try not to focus on my hair anyway um, and I got it done on my toes but I have a design on the big toe and it's like red and black. She like swooped it together. If I think about it, I'll take a picture and show you guys. But anyway, what do I do with this? How do I say nicely to him? Like, give him directions. Like, I thought I was telling him what I wanted. And at first, he had like huge twists going up to the side. And I was like, I said I wanted the little ones. And he's like, why didn't you say anything? And I was like, I did say something. So, I don't know. What I think I'm going to do is, because I think it just looks awkward. Like, this just sitting here like that, it just looks weird. Like, maybe had he taken more of it up or something, like, I don't know. Like, maybe, I don't know. He did a really nice, like, U-shaped twist when I had my mohawk. It was like, he twisted it up a little bit, and then it kind of fell with the rest of it. And it looked really nice, and I just tried to remind him of what he did. And he's like, I don't remember. I don't know what you're talking about. And he couldn't figure it out. But I don't know. His parts, well, not even the parts. It just looks ragged. It looks like something I did. Not ragged, but it just looks like something I did. I'm an amateur. He's a professional. So, I mean, good thing the styles are free with the, um, when I get my hair done. Like, I don't have to pay extra for them. Or I would have figured out a way to say something because <laughs> I don't waste money. But, um, yeah, I don't know. 
I mean, I would say give me suggestions as to how I could fix it, but I don't know. I'm not really feeling it. Sorry, my eyes keep going down. I'm like looking at myself on the camera. I'm just really not feeling it. Um, I think I might just try to take this, whatever it is, out and see if they fall or maybe if I can twist it myself. I don't know. <sighs> Knowing me, if I get frustrated, they'll all end up just loose. So anyway, that's my hair frustrations, whatever. Um, and then I noticed like a lot of people, a few people, not a lot, a few people I was following on YouTube who were having their lock journeys, they're like taking their locks out. So that's kind of disappointing. I guess I'll say disappointing. Um, I do struggle with like sometimes wanting the locks and sometimes I get frustrated with them because this is going on my seventh month now. And if you can see... My hair still hasn't <laughs> locked. It still looks like curls or whatever. I don't know. But they're starting, some of them are starting to kind of like bud up here. So I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, um, that's my hair. That's enough. And in terms of the gym and eating, I did start going to the gym on Tuesday. Um, I made the video. I don't know if I made it a Monday or Sunday or whatever, but... I made the video. I did wake up that next morning and go to my 5 a.m. workout. So I'm excited about that. Um, and I'm, today is day four, so I've gone every morning before work. I don't work Fridays in the summer, so I got up and went with one of my coworkers to the gym today. And we went this morning for about an hour. And I almost killed myself on the treadmill. <laughs> the last time I lost weight, all I did was get on the treadmill. And I would do like three miles a day. So today, I really didn't... I kind of overslept that I was just rushing and I hadn't really thought about what I wanted to do with the gym today, but I've been kind of just taking it easy because I didn't want to like burn myself out since I'm just starting out. So today I said, well, I'm just going to stay on a treadmill because usually I do some elliptical, a little bit of strength training or whatever, but I've done strength training the last two days. So today was kind of my break day. Um... So anyway, um, I was on the treadmill and I almost killed myself. So anyway, my foot, like, I have a habit of drifting. Like, <laughs> I just drift. Even like when I'm walking in person, like, I walk into people. I don't know. I guess I'm off balance and I need to work on that. But like, I'm drifting on the treadmill <laughs> and like my foot, half of my is on the part that's not moving like you know the belt like I've drifted over so much that like I step down as I'm walking and I step half on the part that just stays there <laughs> and basically my ankle I'm like oh my god oh, you know it's kind of embarrassing but I mean I recouped really quickly it wasn't like I didn't fall or anything like that but if you were paying attention to me you would have seen it um and trying to catch myself I think I hurt my left knee because that was my right foot where I did that but I took some glucosamine and it's feeling okay now. I'm just going to rest it um, today. But anyway, so I did make it to the gym. I've been going every day. This is day four. So baby steps. I'm proud of myself. Um, and my weight. I have lost some pounds. Um, I weighed myself Tuesday morning before going to the gym. I was 258.8. <sighs> Woosa, just let it go. And this morning, I was 253.2. So I've lost 58 minus 3 is 5 points, about 6. I lost 5.6 pounds in four days. I know it's probably fluid or whatever, um, but I've been eating healthy for lunch. I've been eating um, like spinach, baby spinach salads with uh, grape tomatoes and I use like an olive oil with just a little salt and pepper for dressing or some, you know, just a little bit of dressing. I just don't go overboard with the dressing. Um, and I've been doing kind of like a high protein, low carb kind of thing. I'm not really prescribing to any particular diet. I'm just kind of, at first I said I was just going to do Atkins, but I just figure... I don't want to deprive myself, so I'm just going to, you know, make wiser choices. Um, so, 
So, really, for the most part, I've just been eating protein and veggies. And each day I have some fruit. So, the first day I think I had cherries and grapefruit. And the next day, the next two days, I had pineapples. And today I've had two apples. Um, I ate them before. But I ate one on the way to the gym and one just on my way home now from the hairdresser because I didn't take anything else with me and it was in my car. But, um... I think that's about it. I've only eaten breakfast today. I had eggs and sausage. Um, so I think I'm going to go cook something. And, yeah. Oh, and I had raisins and peanuts. And I have to cut back on that. Um, but I had just bought some. So I think when I'm done with the batch that I have, I'm just going to just not buy any more. Because I like to make my own trail mix or whatever. But I think, because um, I, I don't know. It can kind of, I go, I can go overboard with them. So I think I'm just going to, you know, enjoy them while they last. And then when they're done, they're done. So anyway, those are all of my updates. I'll post a few pictures at the end to say what I did with this thing on my head. Mm. I guess it doesn't look terrible, but I don't know. I'm not very good at styling. Sorry, this was a pin <laughs> that was in my hair. But, yeah, anyway, I'm rambling. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. So, my sister said I was being ridiculous. She took out the top one that was right there. I'm going to do a spin for you real quick. So... That's it. I mean, I think it looks a little bit better, but she said if I don't like it by the end of the day, she'll um, take some more hair out of these twists so it'll be fuller, but it is 100 degrees down here, so maybe I need to keep it like that. So, that's it. Bye. I wanted to come back and show y'all who's always taunting me. Excuse my bathroom. This is who was barking and would not let me sleep. And now he's standing in here. And he knows we don't like each other, so he's about to go. Bye.